Hi everyone, uh, this video is just a quick uh, video tutorial about how you can access to your favorite uh, report by default within uh, Math 180 So for this, uh, the, it's, it's just a little tip. Um, so as you can see here within uh, the um, uh, personal settings part, you are getting a part here which is related to uh, the report to load by default. In fact, here report to load by default within Matomo refer to either uh, the list of all the website or either to the list, uh, either to the default dashboard of one of your websites. So, uh, in order for this trick uh, to happen, you need to select the second option, which is the dashboard for a specific website, and then uh, you need, of course, to access to uh, your uh, your website. Then. Uh, what about uh, having an access to uh, your favorite uh, report? Well, in fact, what you can just do is that you can just uh, delete, in fact, all the different widgets which are over here. And here you are kind of seeing the, 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 the trick, let's say, uh, that you want to, uh, to achieve. In my case, uh, let's imagine that the uh, report that I would like to get an access to is a custom report or an acquisition report or anything like this. Well, I can in fact easily uh, decide to modify here my dashboard uh, to change it and make it just on one page. And just because I selected the, let's say, the acquisition and all channel types or something like this. Um, well, in fact, I already have it on this um, on this report. So as far as I go down, uh, I should be all right. Okay, uh, and here it is. Um, I have in fact my favorite report, which will be loaded by default just because I added one single widget on the dashboard. So as far as I'm within the first dashboard, which has been created, I will be fine, and I can like this display all the time this given. Uh, report, uh, which is the equivalent of the one that I have, that I have over here, and and I'm all fine. In fact, I'm just getting exactly uh, the same report. Of course, if I really would like it to be displayed the way it is here, I just need to go for a two-third and one-third um, table. But the thing is that I'm I'm getting it exactly um, the way I'm I'm having it on the other um, the other report. So. Um, the job is made just with the simple trick, which is to select your uh, favorite widget, which will be the equivalent of your favorite report, as uh, the only widget that you will have within your um, dashboard. And um, you can, in fact, uh, do great stuff because you could definitely um, have dashboards such as this one, on which uh, you could just have one widget, full page, which will display kind of all the news regarding your company. Um, so it's not probably your favorite report, but you can in fact use it as definitely an information portal in order to uh, show out all the information that you want to the employee within your organization. Thanks for watching.